Hey, good morning, everyone. Pastor Brett here. Uh, all right. I'm um, thinking about uh, a conversation. I was, um, I guess I was challenged a bit this morning. Um, didn't really see it as much of a challenge. Um, someone was reading words into my words. I responded recently to a um, a uh, a video by a particular Christian apologetics teacher um, and preacher, and uh, I um, in listening to this video um, and his response to another believer, and I say this other person is a believer because. Um, he, the Bible says, if you repent and confess Christ, you're born again. Amen. So this person has done that. Um, he believes in the Jesus of the Bible. He, he knows who Jesus is. Um, and so, uh, um, I don't defend some of the things that this person teaches or preaches though. Um, and not so much as preaching as much as his um, living it out. Um, when you're burning Bibles and you're um, um, when you're burning Bibles and you're doing other things like hating um, people that struggle with particular sin issues, uh, you know, you need to think about that. First of all, you shouldn't be hating anyone. You should be praying for them and loving them. Yes, we should hate evil, but evil is evil. Evil is that uh, force that Satan uses to um, manipulate people to do the wrong things, to make the wrong choices in life. Um, Satan's a liar and a deceiver, and that's how he wins. Uh, we need to be about our business, get in the Word, love one another, um, don't debate with one another, um, fighting with one another, trying to win a pissing contest every time you talk about each other. Uh, it, it's, it's all that it's become. Where is the love of Jesus Christ in all of that? Okay, that was my point to um, one particular individual who I thought would be the one that should be being the elder of the two. I thought that he should um, be a, uh, I don't know, more talent, more um, humble, um, be the one that um, takes the step and says, I apologize, uh, I'm willing to humble myself and say I was wrong, I should have loved you and we should have uh, agreed to disagree on particular topics and moved on with each other. Instead, we, you know, been tearing into each other since. Um, so, I mean, you know, uh, it is what it is. Uh, I don't know. And, and my biggest issue was this. If you would um, tell another um, believer um, that it's wrong to burn, you know, NIV Bibles uh, for a, a, a cookout, have a cookout with NIV Bibles, um, that's just wrong. It's just dead wrong, man. You just don't you don't do that. I'm not going to burn the word. And the NIV um, is just as much the word of God as the King James Version. It's just missing a whole lot. But we know why. Um, so uh, it is what it is. You know, um, I love these brothers. Um, I haven't mentioned their names. Um, I'm not going to ask you to try to figure it out. Uh, if you think you know, please don't post it. Um, doesn't need to be posted. Uh, the point is, is that um, how do you love one another as Christ loved the church? You know, how do we follow that command to love one another? Uh, and uh, you know, read First John and tell me, you know, how we're supposed to love one another. Um, do we, like Paul said in Galatians, um, bite and devour one another? Or do we, you know, love one another as Christians in the Christian community, in the body of Christ, the like minded one Lord, one faith, one baptism, Christ, you know? Um, yeah, so 
How do you love one another? Love one another. Yeah. Um, if I disagree with you on something, and I've had disagreements with many, um, but because they've handled it respectfully, uh, I, we've had, you know, a respectful, you know, rapport as a result. And we get along. You know, we agree to disagree on that particular issue, and we move on. You know, um, if I would entitle this particular video um, thinking of a title, I'm thinking about, you know, agree to disagree. Ah, that is the question. Thank you, Jesus. Do you agree to disagree? Oh, yeah. Should we? Yeah. Should we agree to disagree? I say yes. I say yes. I say yes. I say that's a mark of humility. That's a mark of um, a peaceful man. Uh, blessed are the peacemakers. Amen. Matthew. All right. The Beatitudes. The Sermon on the Mount. Jesus said, Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the children of God. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Um, thank you, Lord, for your word. I pray that you bless the body of believers hallelujah, with your word. And I pray that you would strengthen us and help us to understand and apply your word. Hallelujah. As uh, you would have us do. Amen. So uh, we thank you, we praise you, and we surrender everything to your care. Um, and I say thank you for watching, everybody. Um, Jesus loves you, and we truly love you. Have a great day. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name.